you see Colleen Isabella and you think it's a jewelry brand, you know, some people will see a lifestyle brand, but the first thing that I always say is that we're an opportunity for women. The jewelry is simply the vehicle by which we empower these fashion-loving entrepreneurs, which is what every single one of our merchandisers is. After spending about 15 years in fashion and retail, I kind of reached a point in my life where I wanted to do something that could make a difference in someone's life. Becoming a merchandiser is two things that we're really trying to make a match on. One is creative and confident woman. When I first joined Chloe and Isabel, I had two major goals. One was philanthropic and the other was to harness my creative instinct. It was a New Year's resolution to be fearless and here I am doing things that I haven't done before. The other thing that we're also looking for is what are they trying to get out of it? Do they want to make money? Do they want experience? Are they trying to build their resume? There's so many different reasons in which we help support these women so that they can get to the next step in their life. I started three years ago as a merchandiser and here now I'm the associate fashion director on the corporate side. My biggest goal this year is to complete the first draft of my novel. A whole nother level of selling yourself. So from Chloe and Isabel you can gain so many other skills. We are the destination for the entrepreneur. I love it. It excites me and it drives me and motivates me. I'm given these jewels and I'm given these resources and I can really make it my own. We're teaching her how to merchandise as a Chloe and Isabel store. The boutiques, which is another thing that we built that no one else has. It's completely personalized and curated by you. I like thinking out how I'm going to display things. I've been setting up some photo shoots with my creative friends. I'll put some fall pieces together with some spring pieces that I think look nice. How does this work into your schedule? Do you have five hours a week to spend on Chloe and Isabel? Do you have 20 hours a week? Yeah, on average, I guess I'm probably putting in about half hour to an hour a day. Pop onto Facebook in the morning and, I mean, I don't even have to get out of bed to do that. <laughs> so you're definitely in control of how you're working and, and where you want to do it. The majority of our merchandisers have never done direct sales in their lives. We've actually been able to create an opportunity that's attracting a completely different demographic. I do really love the jewelry. I am very passionate about it. People see through that passion, and that alone sells itself. Even I wasn't really sure that I had any entrepreneurial spirit. She came in with basically a 60-day goal, and she hit it in 30 days, and she was excited because of how much money she's making through this. It's because of that opportunity. So I'm so grateful for it. This was exactly what she needed. And this gives me something that I can be passionate and excited about and can talk about and, you know, just bring people into that enthusiasm. I see it as putting myself out there. I think maybe I hadn't been doing that for a little while. You just don't realize sometimes, like, you're impacting people in so many different ways. You're changing lives that go so far beyond the person. We've had multiple merchandisers who land their dream job. I've done a lot of things. Maybe they're all finally coming together. It's a different kind of motivation when you wake up in the morning. I'm motivated to watch these women grow, but more importantly, watch them realize their dreams. Colleen Isabel, I want people to fall in love with the brand and then be really excited to discover that there's a real opportunity behind this brand and that it means so much more. You can spend your life not doing a lot of things, so I think I want to spend my life doing a lot of things and this is helping me.